Yo, what's up guys, Kevin here. In this video, I wanna do an unboxing of the new GoPro Hero 9 Black. If you guys have been watching the channel, I've used GoPros for the last nine years, been upgrading every year. They always seem to add something new to the GoPro that just makes it a better camera for filming. So let's unbox this one and then see what they've added to the GoPro this year. So right off the bat, I've noticed that the packaging is much different. It's a much simpler box. And then we have this case right here. You have the standard GoPro parts, You've got the charging cable, two mounts, and the camera. And the packaging on the inside is like much, I think more environmentally friendly, just simple recycled paper in there. So let's get rid of that. But my first impressions is the GoPro is definitely bigger. It seems like it's just slightly bigger than the old GoPros. There's a front facing camera now, a larger back screen, the bigger camera size, also the front facing camera. So if I'm filming myself, I can actually see myself in the video. And then the much larger screen at the back for lining up a shot. On the inside of the camera, it's got GoPro's Hyper Smooth version three. So for filming action sports, for getting that smooth look without the shake, the GoPro 8 has been amazing for that. Definitely helped to get rid of having to use a gimbal at all. And for the GoPro 9, they've added horizon lock. So you can actually lock onto the horizon and keep the camera view perfectly level. Joe, do you wanna try just holding the camera and running with it? Run down? Yeah, just run. <laughs> I like how you can see there's selfie mode in this one. Oh. Here, now run with this one. <laughs> to be fair, there was more of a hill on the first one though. So let's take a look at the battery. And the battery that they've used for the GoPro is actually a larger battery. I don't know if it's actually larger in size, but there's more capacity. I think a third more battery life, which is key for GoPros in the past using the GoPro 8. If I'm out filming for four or five hours, I may have to bring four or five batteries with me. So with this larger battery size, hopefully we get some more battery life. Another upgrade on this camera over the 8 is that you can now film in 5K which is something I think for the average videographer, you may not be filming in 5K, but it's kind of cool to have that option. But overall, I'm pretty stoked on this camera. I like the front facing screen, the larger battery life, the build of it feels really good as well, very durable. I've had nine GoPros now and they've all lasted through snow and rain and getting thrown and dropped. So I'm really stoked on the build of the GoPros in general. I think the GoPro 9 could be the way to go because of all these improvements. But let me know down in the comments, guys, what you think of this new camera. And subscribe, guys, because I'll be filming with this camera and testing it out here in Austria on an upcoming snowboard trip. Thank you guys for watching. Have fun out there making videos, and I'll see you in the next one soon.